is day 13 of corn harvest and I'm pretty sure this is gonna be our last day. I got my new Carhartt hat in the mail. I love it. The fit is so much better than the male's cut. So if you're a girl and you need a hat, Carhartt, the women's cut. Also, my favorite color used to be teal, but I'm thinking it might be changing to purple now. All right, I'm letting all my chickens out. It's so nice that I get light in the morning and uh, then I'm off to day 13 of corn harvest. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Tara, a farmer from Northern California, just trying to learn the ropes. This is the last episode of my corn harvest series. If you've been here the whole time, thank you so much. If you're new, please hit the thumbs up. Please hit the subscribe. You can check out all my past corn harvest series videos. This has been to help me get used to YouTube and there's no stopping me now. You guys are loving it. I'm enjoying you guys being here. We're gonna all learn farming together. All right, day 13 of corn harvest, our last day. Good day, Sacramento's here. Yay! <laughs> today and I actually get to ride in the bank out wagon. Power didn't go out today so today's last day of corn harvest guys. sister before and I said oh yeah why and he said I dated her friend Gloria yeah he said it was years ago but... yeah yeah we talked about it funny huh small world which I know yeah next year if I do this I'm going to do one
can test them all. What about Mormon? What about him? Yeah. He wants to, to know when I can come, and I told him I'd have to ask, talk to you. You never told me. This is it. This is going to be the last of Corn Harvest 19. It's crazy. This is what we work all year for. I always said they're fields of gold that unfortunately seem to be worth nothing. I need to clean my windows. Sorry, everybody. I'll clean my windows after this load. Yeah, I've got a, little, got a few spider webs on there. A little bit of dust. Okay. Let me just clean these windows. myself with the windshield wiper. Oh gosh, there's already oh, spider mite webs to be bad in this field. Ooh. I'm gonna try not to die. Okay. Back window. Not gonna lie, I think my biggest learning curve for YouTube has been learning how to do everything with one arm. Did it. Now you guys have a better view. Ugh. Okay. Yay. My grapes right there. We're right behind my grapes. So much for clean windows. Try. My eyes are still itchy from having crap in them yesterday. 
A few people have asked me to put cameras on the auger. Well, all I record with is my phone. I don't have a GoPro or anything. So I don't really have anything to put out there. But you just watching my channel and thumbs upping my video helps me. So, you know, the, the longer I do this, maybe I'll be able to afford things like that, but not quite yet. All I've got is a phone, using what I got. Wow, this is it, everybody. I can't believe it. I followed through with my self-challenge of making video every day of corn harvest. 13 days, which could be short for some people, long for some people. It wasn't really that many days, but it sure felt stretched out. But, uh, I can't believe it. It's over. I mean, or it's almost over. I just appreciate everyone so much for following along and being encouraging. Honestly, I had no idea so many people were gonna watch. <laughs> so, it's been fun. I only got to drive the harvester one day. That was kind of a bummer, but my dad likes to drive it. I feel like last year, last year or the year before, I felt like I drove it a lot. I think my dad just had a lot going on and I just did it by a good chunk by myself. We also had a lot less corn this year. I mean, the past years, my dad's had closer to 700, 800 acres of corn, and this year we only had 200. I guess when I go two miles an hour, it's not fast enough. <coughs> Are you still going two miles an hour? <coughs> That's all we have left. This little chunk right here. That's it. We're almost finished. Persimmons. You guys like persimmons? We have the most massive persimmon tree at my house. Um, I need to pick more before they go bad. I just like eating them plain. But I also like to make persimmon cookies. I have my great grandma's recipe and also dried persimmons. They're just like such a short season, so I gotta take advantage. He's making his last pass. That's the end. That's the last bit of corn I'm gonna dump. It's the end, guys. Wow. There it is. It's almost at the end. He's driving back to the truck. Gonna dump the last little bit into the truck and that's it. It's gonna make it a wrap. Last load. Harvest 2019 is done. That's a wrap. 
I almost can't even believe it. We got so lucky this year. I know so many people are dealing with bad weather. Oh, and, and we've been there. I mean, we don't get snow here, but we've been there where we're, uh, the rain is chasing us, you know? We're trying to get it up for the rain and we were blessed this year. Uh, seriously, I mean, we've had beautiful weather. We had the one, two days of really terrible wind, but it's been sunny. We got the corn out. And I did a video every day, which I'm so proud of myself for following through with that. And I just like, I had no idea so many people were gonna be interested. I'm so excited to see where my channel goes. This is just the beginning. This got me comfortable. I edited a video almost every day, got them up online. So this video has got a lot of growth coming. If you're new, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe, it means so much to me. This is just the beginning. Now we've got groundwork, we're gonna be disking, planting alfalfa, a little bit more leveling. This winter we got stuff going on in the grapes, I've got a hedge, I'm hoping to plant a cover crop, pruning, training. Let's drive it back over here, that was it. And pretty exciting. Alright. Driving the tractor home. That's it, man. Woo! Get it. We did it.